Hey, welcome to the Magic Website Builder inside of Zista, which uses the advanced techniques inside the Magic SEO Writer to build richly optimized static HTML sites. Now, if you want to better understand what exactly optimization techniques are being used, I would recommend watching the tutorial for the Magic SEO Writer. But in essence, Magic Website Builder uses the AI writing set up in Magic SEO Writer to produce websites that you can either use as real money sites or as PBNs. You can use them to occupy more spots in search or you can just use them as backlinks for your money site. In addition, you can use Magic Website Builder to either build these lovely looking, lightweight, static HTML sites or build out robustly optimized WordPress sites which you can deploy to your own WordPress site by using the push to WordPress tool and you enter in the creden your WordPress credentials as you're instructed over here. And there are two ways that you can build it. You can either do it, do it fully on autopilot or manually control all the parameters. First, let's go over the automatic website generation method. Right up top here, you would select your client if you already have the appropriate client inside the client's manager, in which case you can import their information. If not, then you would just add a new client in business, add the client name, which would add it in the client's manager, and this would be the web's name of the, that you want the website to be. Otherwise, let's just choose an existing client. Let's make this website, let's call this website agency intelligence. And over here, we will put in all the primary keywords we want to make articles about. Either we can do one or we can do manual, many. For this purpose, I'm going to do one. And this is what you would want to use. This is, this is where you put the keywords you would want to use if you want Zista to find images using the Pexels API to put into your article. Now, there is a way to check first if it's going to give you the appropriate images. For example, I'm going to go to pexels.com, and I have already searched for advertising. So you can see the kinds of images it's going to select for the article. It's going to be one of these. You can customize the search from location so that magic, the magic writer can grab content and optimize it based on that particular geolocation. So, since we're targeting Houston, I'm going to put in Houston, Texas, United States. There we go. Website ain't language. Change it if you want it to be in something other than English. And number of supporting articles for each Magic SEO article. The writer is going to generate topically relevant supporting articles around this keyword. You can choose to toggle on or off FAQs. And then let's generate it. If you wanted to take a direct look at the progress, you would click an article list and you're going to see all the different articles as they build out and write. Magic, magic SEO articles, these are the main ones, and the supporting articles are the supporting articles for their respective main articles. Okay, I'm gonna give it a few more minutes. Once the site is all generated, you would click the three dots next to your site and this would show us generate preview. If you haven't yet generated a preview, click on that. Wait a minute. Once it's done, this link will turn into preview and you get to view a live preview of your site. Okay, here is our generated site. Right over here, we've got the primary article, which is optimized using magic SEO techniques, as well as a brief overview of the supporting articles. Check out this beautiful, richly optimized, AI-generated primary article with, a with all the relevant keywords taken from your competition, optimized to our proprietary algorithm based on our experience and testing of what works. Right over here, we've got an FAQ section. Here's the other thing. I've got detailed SEO Chrome extension over here. And when we head on over to the schema section, we can see that Magic Website Builder built a site that gives us FAQ schema. Telling the bots what this is all about. 
When we navigate to the supporting blog posts, see, here's another relevant image that was found by the Pexels API. And at the bottom, we can see a related link. Next, we're going to show you the manually customized website option. Now, the setup here for the keyword setup is pretty much the same. Just one extra thing I wanted to tell you whenever you're selecting your keywords and your image keywords. Now, be sure to differentiate your titles and main keywords from each other. If you were to build pages that are similar keywords but different cities, it will give you the same image from Pexel. So if you wanted to vary that up and give some visual variety, I would suggest putting in different keywords. Like here, Cybersecurity Consulting Houston, Managed Service Provider Houston. For this reason, if you want to do geotargeting on your magic sites, my recommendation is to keep it to one city per magic site. Image keywords, you can either insert one per article or you can just insert one over here. Again, you need to search Pexels to, to kind of give you an idea of what's on there. And I highly recommend making it one word when possible because that's what gets the best results when it comes to getting images from Pexels. All right. Again, set your search from location to whatever you want it to be. Houston, Texas. Website language, FAQs. Again, set your number of supporting articles per primary article. And you have a choice and you have a choice of letting it automatically find titles or subject for subjects for each supporting article, or if you prefer to bring a list of your own long tail keywords or like things to do or different things like that, you have the option to do that, especially if you want to rank some additional long tails in the SERPs. You have the option to do that for each of these different primary keywords, vary the number of supporting articles if you like. The number of external links is if you believe in the concept of creating external links to places like Wikipedia or big authority sites because you believe that Google will, that will help connect the dots with Google, you can either choose to include as many as you want per keyword or include none. We got a couple themes to choose from if you want to vary up the look and feel of your websites. If you want to add a logo to your website, you can upload it here. You can upload a fav icon that would display in the browser. And this is the featured image for your supporting articles. You can customize the text color and you can also customize the background color of this area right here left to this area where it will select an image relevant to the keyword that you are targeting. If you know something about internal linking structures, you can choose from all the different popular types of internal linking structures. For the purposes of this demonstration, I'm going to choose a star linking where every single, where every single related article is going to interlink between each other and, of course, link back to the primary money page in this site. Either that, or if you're building multiple sites at once, you can turn this switch on and it will choose randomly from this list of six different internal linking structures. I'm gonna leave these settings at default for now, but just to let you know what these do, you have the option to add additional tracking scripts if you wanna put Google Analytics in there, for example. These are if you wanted to add additional custom HTML content into the header or footer of the website. For example, if you have a widget that you wanted to display, you can embed that and you can put anything you want. Customize the robots.txt. You can either add or remove the index.html to your homepage depending on what you prefer. You can add social profiles if this is related to a brand that has social profiles or if you own that brand. You can put in a contact name, address, and phone number, privacy policy, terms of use, a site map, and an RSS feed if that's your thing. Always, always make sure there's an H1 there for, because search engines just like that. And you can choose to customize the language if you're targeting an international audience. And there you have it. I'm going to wait another couple minutes and skip right past the process because I already showed that to you for 
the automatically generated site. And presto, here is the second finished product. Right off the bat, you'll notice some differences. Of course, we selected the second theme and we also inputted a couple primary keywords. So we got two main articles, managed service provider Houston, highly relevant content, with an FAQ section. And because we chose the star internal linking scheme, we have one layer of internal links to all of the supporting articles. And when we scroll down in the supporting article, we can see that it links back to, the primary, to its corresponding primary article, as well as to all the other supporting articles categorized under this. Same thing with the other primary article. Check this out. Cybersecurity Consulting Houston. Are cybersecurity consultants in demand? Goes back to Cybersecurity Consulting Houston. Now, with the advanced manual options, not only do you get a site, with content that is richly optimized with keywords and entities and LSI strategically placed all over paragraphs and headings and based directly on your competition, but it's also interlinked so that the articles can send link juice to each other and you get maximum ranking benefit. Now keep in mind that what we demonstrated here is the star linking diagram, which is the most sophisticated and involved internal linking models of the six that we offer here. With that being said, you can choose from any of these six internal linking mechanisms depending on how you send your backlinks. So for example, if you wanted to send all your, all your backlinks to one post and it distributes to the rest, then you could choose the sequential linking and, and send backlinks to the post in the bottom. You could do single page linking and send backlinks to each of these supporting posts. Spoke circular linking is another model and octopus linking is another hub and spoke model with these five pages going to the, going to another page. We just demonstrated star linking here because that's the most sophisticated and involved internal linking model that we support. Okay. And there you have it in less than two to three minutes each clean HTML SEO optimized sites that you can then upload to any number of cloud hostings or to WordPress or even to your own web server via FTP if that's what you have. Okay. As always, if you've got any questions, let us know in the chat box at the bottom right. Thank you so much for watching and happy SEOing.